Hello caffeine fiends and welcome to another video for www.getbean.com This is the voice of Vince, the Mean Bean Machine, coming at you and today we're looking at how to make the coffee-based, non-alcoholic, vegan cocktail the Coconut Shakerato. So, with the warmer weather just around the corner and summer on the way, let's take a look at how to make this. So you will need several very simple things. First of all, four shots of coffee. Then, eight mint leaves some ice, a bag of ice, some agave nectar, coconut milk or coconut rice milk, and a cocktail shaker, preferably with drainer included. Don't forget to prep your ice a couple of hours beforehand or even the night before. Pour yourself four coffee shots in any manner you see fit. Obviously here I'm using an espresso machine, but a cafetiere French press or AeroPress will work just as well. Measure out 100 millilitres of coconut drinking milk. Make sure it is drinking milk, also known as coconut rice milk sometimes, and not the cooking kind. Pour your coconut milk into the cocktail shaker. Add about 8 cubes of ice to the cocktail shaker. Obviously this will vary depending on how much you're serving, how big your cocktail shaker is and how large the chunks of ice are. But for about 2 servings, 8 chunks of ice is about right. Take your mint leaves and remove 2, set them aside for later and add the other 6 to the cocktail shaker as well. Then pour your coffee shots into the mix too. Measure out about two teaspoons of agave syrup. Put these into the cocktail shaker and stir vigorously to make sure all of the syrup is off of the spoon. Place the lid of the cocktail shaker on and make sure it is secured so it cannot slip. Now you're going to want to shake the concoction vigorously, trying to break down all of the ice that is inside. This may take a while, but don't worry. The ice doesn't need to be crushed, it just needs to be broken. Go ready to pour, remove the top lid and strain through the cocktail strainer. If you don't have a cocktail strainer on your cocktail shaker, a tea strainer will do. Pour in two equal amounts and add mint leaves at the end to garnish. Finally, just serve and enjoy. Thank you for watching. Do hit those like and subscribe buttons and check us out at www.getbean.com.